So guys, today it's Sunday and we have a training ways for the young birds and we also have a few um, old birds on it as well. So we're gonna watch the birds getting home and then uh, we have 22 young birds with it and five old birds. So we're gonna watch them. Go. So at this point we have now I think 12 young birds at home or 13 maybe we still need a few more the first one was my favorite one was this young bird, 708. She came together with an old bird. She flew around 95 kilometers an hour, so really fast. And the second one was the red one right there. So yeah, we need, we still need a few more. Already feed the birds something, as you can see, still something in it. We need to clean the loft. I will do it uh, after this. So yeah, we have for these young birds, they came really quick to home. So that's great. And uh, we're just gonna wait for the others to return back as well. That one behind the red one, I think he uh, was in somebody else's loft because the coloring I put on was off. Or maybe he lost it somewhere, not sure. But I think he was um, in another loft and came um, back after that. So, the young birds. So, guys, at this point, we still need five more young birds. But we got most of them back. It's now uh, waning, a little bit of uh, heavy rain. So it's not that great, but at least the birds can drink on the way back home. So that's great. So yeah, the first one we got was the 708. It's my favorite one. It's a really tame pigeon. He's right here, or she, I think it's an hen. So. so yeah, we got most of them back. We will feed them and then uh, it's done for today. Next weekend we got a ways from a place in Gelderland, it's called Duiven 
in, if, we, if we translate it to English, it will be Pigeons, but it's just a place in uh, Gelderland, the Netherlands. It is a race about, I think for us, it will be 120 kilometers, not pretty sure, but it's around that. So today, the next thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna chip the birds. That means they get a, a wing on the left leg that will registrate the birds when they are back home on the system. So that's also what we uh, will do today. I won't put it in the in the video, maybe in the, another one. I will see if I will, will be recording that, but it's not that uh, serious to see. So at least we got, I think we had 21, 22 youngsters in the way so we got 70 back so it's not that bad for the first time they also went were, were inside for a week and they only trained a few times before we put them on the training so um, we didn't bring them on the training toss so yeah it's not that bad to still uh, need five more pigeons but yeah they can come later so yeah the day isn't over Maybe tomorrow we get some back, who knows. We will see and if we if we get anything back, I will let you guys know. This bird was the first one. Nice pigeon, it's really my favorite one. She uh, was already tame when I released of a winter from her parents. And as you can see, she's always uh, interesting in seeing me and yeah, wants to play. As you can see right now. So yeah. Great that that was my first pigeon. Really happy about it. So also the thing that we um, gonna do is uh, we put some Belgasol in the drinking bowl that will uh, re rehydrate the birds faster and they can uh, yeah become back to power a lot easier than um, if we want to do that. It's not necessary but it's always a thing that I do after the races and especially the first first few races so so yeah we got most bird back still need five more so I'm gonna feed the birds and then uh, we are ready so we're gonna feed the young birds a lightweight mixture just because it was the first time for them in the in the trailer of the department so they got a little bit of uh, stress so to prevent coli or anything else we're gonna give them a lightweight mixture easy to uh, to get so and hopefully with that we won't get anything like coli or anything else so that's what we're gonna give them right now then also we're gonna check if they all want to eat of course we had a few birds that didn't went on the ways so maybe they won't are not that hungry but for the rest they are eating I already feed them something when they get back home so maybe they are not that hungry but for most of them they're eating well so I think uh, it will be fine so uh, just leave it like that. So we feed the old birds as well. They also get a lightweight mixture, the Gabi van den Aanbelen mixture from Bias. They have a short distance race for the next weekend, so they don't need uh, that much of energy. The only thing they have to do is uh, keep uh, not heavy and uh, race very fast. So. So guys, and this also was the video. I hope you liked the video. Please give a thumbs up. Also subscribe to my channel. You can do it down below. Would appreciate it. See you in the next one. Bye guys.